Hello, it's Friday, March 27th. I'm Megan Peterson with your Catch Can Daily News Weekly Recap. The Ketchikan School Board met Wednesday and mistakenly broke protocol to appoint a new member to replace Colleen Scanlon, who resigned in February. The school board seated Conan Steele in an administrative and procedural mistake on Wednesday. The board voted 3-2 to two in favor of Steele's appointment. However, the board policy requires a four-vote majority in order to appoint a new member. The school board planned to meet Friday evening to ratify the vote. The other candidate for the open school board seat is Matt Tibbles. A new ferry service is planned to run between Coffin Cove on Prince of Wales Island, Wrangell, and Petersburg four days a week, beginning June 14th. The 65-foot ferry, the Rainforest Islander, will be operated by the North End Ferry Authority based in Coffin Cove, and its schedule will create a link with the Inner Ireland Ferry and the Alaska Marine Highway System. One person died in the Monday morning house fire on the 2100 block of First Avenue in Ketchikan. George Mather Jr. was the only victim of the house fire, which investigators say was sparked by an electrical issue. In local schools, 80 Schoenbar Middle School 8th graders participated in a styrofoam plane competition earlier this week. The planes were weighted with pennies and the winning team successfully carried 27 pennies. In sports, the Ketchikan Killer Whale swim team will host the Mike Smithers Spring Splash this weekend at the Ketchikan Gateway Aquatic Center. Some 70 swimmers from Ketchikan Craig and Juno will compete in the three-day meet. Check the Monday edition of the Ketchikan Daily News for coverage. That's it for your Ketchikan Daily News weekly recap. Check out this weekend's edition for Waterfront. It will have a look at the commercial dive fishery for red e sea urchins in southern southeast Alaska. And the scene will feature two local artists and their two different projects on William Seward. All right, here's the photo of the week. Have a good weekend. Thank you.